Sustainability of the foods we eat is a hot topic these days, and one place you'll often see a sustainable food chain in action is in the hustle and bustle of your local fish market. This week's FRDC food species is the Morton Bay bug, and I'm here with Chef Paul Brahini. Now, Paul, they're an unusual looking creature, but they sure taste good. How are you gonna cook them? I'm gonna barbecue the bug tails, and I'm gonna serve them on a healthy quinola salad. Well, while you're cooking the bugs, let's find out about this tasty crustacean. What you buy as the iconic Morton Bay bug could actually be one of two species, Thensis australiensis or Thenus perindicus. While they're caught mainly in southern Queensland, yes, where Morton Bay is, they're found all the way around to Western Australia and even in other places around the world. However, the WA catch is so insignificant that bug stocks there are undefined. Now, rosemary goes so well with crustacean. Really, really does. Everywhere else, the Morton Bay bug is classified sustainable. I just want to get a little bit of char grill. And you probably won't be surprised to hear that most of the Morton Bay bugs you buy actually come from Queensland. Now, this quinoa I uh, boiled a little bit earlier with some salt and just some water. So I'm going to add my mint. What the mint does is really freshen up this dish. Some beautiful ruby red grapefruit goes in. I'm gonna save a couple for garnish. I'm gonna pop the capsicum in, a little bit of color. Just on some julienne of zucchini. Gives it a really nice crunch and color through the dish. So I'm just gonna throw a little bit of red onion in here, just for a bit of bite. And some vinaigrette as well. Toss it all together. Now I'm just going to use some of these beautiful grapefruits just on the top, just to give it a little bit of colour. And now I'm going to pop my chagrill bugs on top. Take your bug tails out, just pop them on top of the quinoa salad. It's really, really important that you cook them in the shells. They've got that beautiful smoky smell to them at the moment. Just going to top with some vinaigrette. Lovely. Well, mate, I'm looking forward to tasting these bugs. Now, for more information and figures on Morton Bay bugs, go to fish.gov.au or visit fishfiles.com.au for loads of nutritional information, serving ideas and recipes. And head to the Escape With ET website for Paul's Morton Bay bug dish.